Um, so kind of combining this philosophical turn that we seem to have taken with uh -huh. the practical work that you do, how did you decide to look abroad um, as one focus of your, of, your, of your philanthropy versus things closer to home? You know, I get asked that a lot, and it's a good question, because the, honestly, I can tell you much more about the education system in Ghana than I can about New York City public schools, which is where I live. Um, and the reason really is kind of by circumstance. So one thing that we, uh, I was actually volunteering in Tanzania, and um, I met my mother in Ghana because we'd heard that Opportunity International was just kind of beginning to lend to schools. They weren't sure how to do it. Um, or, you know, kind of what the problem was, we were just forming the foundation. And so we met up in Ghana and started just kind of asking lots of questions and saw this opportunity that there was a gap here in this market that microfinance institutions couldn't figure out how to lend to schools and schools couldn't figure out how to manage themselves well enough to get these loans. So there, there, was, a, there was an opportunity there to create a program and that's, that's really why we ended up there. So it wasn't something where we said, here's this idea, where should we go? We found it in the communities that we ended up working in and now we're looking at replicating that program in other places.